Good morning. I'm Janelle Burrell. It's your morning digital news brief for this Tuesday, January 16th. Two men were hurt in a row home fire in North Philadelphia. Crews were called to Fawn Street just after 1 o'clock this morning. Firefighters quickly getting out those heavy flames while also dealing with the cold and the snow. Investigators are working to determine the cause of the fire. And an investigation also underway into the cause of this church fire in Overbrook. Crews called to Overbrook Presbyterian Church just after 7, just before 7.30 last night. Investigators say the church had heavy damage. And the Eagles season is officially over. The team back in snowy Philadelphia after losing to Tampa 32-9. to We see Jason Kelsey there, who the NFL Network is reporting is officially retiring. Let's get you caught up on our next weather forecast. Here's meteorologist Kate Philo. Hi, Kate. Hey there, Janelle. We are still timing out wintry weather here this morning. We picked up a general two to four inches of snow across much of the area last night, especially from the city into the nearby north and west suburbs, one to three inches across much of South Jersey. But now we're seeing some freezing rain and sleet, which is leading to more slippery and dangerous conditions on local roadways. You can see as we go through the morning, we've got a little bit of everything from rain down the shore to that dangerous freezing rain where you see the pink across South Jersey and Delaware and even more snow for areas to the north and west. So now you're get getting that light glaze of ice on any untreated surface, which will lead to very, very slippery conditions. If you already shoveled your front walkway, but you didn't put any salt down or anything like that, it is likely to become a skating rink. You may want to leave the snow there and get that kind of crunchy the ice on top. Wait until this is all done to really treat things. So through early afternoon, we could still pick up an icy glaze around the city. One to two inches of snow still possible far north and west. Again, the impacts will be travel related, basically icy and slippery roads, and we'll have some black ice, some refreezing as we go through tonight. Closures and delays will continue. Even some some after school activities, some evening activities may be canceled with the road conditions as they are. And then our next weather alerts continue to pile up. Tomorrow it is the brutal cold. It's going to feel no better than the teens and single digits. Another chance for some light snow on Friday, then another blast of Arctic air for the weekend. Janelle, I'll send it back over to you. All right, thank you, Kate. And you can always get Kate's updated forecast and the latest stories here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great day.